Hello everybody, Padrisha here, and I was not expecting it to start like this. <laughs> uh, welcome to my new Let's Play of Gravity Rush, oh, oh, <laughs> Gravity Rush Remastered. Yeah, just, uh, pre press accept on the, oh, okay. Again. This will... Majority be a blind let's play, but many years ago I did see let's play of this by a uh, leather YouTuber who goes by name of Kabar Mani four five six. He introduced me to Gravity Rush, <laughs> and like. I haven't been. I didn't get to play play originally on the Vita because I didn't have a Vita at the time. But hey, with the remastered, I can get to find play. I, I played the second game. Uh, I I did a little stream event. I think about two years ago or last year. Of Gravity Rush Two, but I never played the first game. So this will be my technically first time playing it. Now, the, yeah, the, this was originally a PS Vita game, but remastered for the PS4. Can't actually believe I'm experiencing this game for myself, first person. Uh, I'm not sure if I will do 100%, if there is 100%, but this game is pretty short according to the size I saw. It's about 13 hours or so. So, not that bad. Hmm. <clears throat> So what's gonna what's happening here? The apples fall. The apple falls far from the tree. Rush. Yeah, that, that, that seems a bit dark, don't you think? What are you doing here? Are you lost too? Well, I don't have anything to give you, so run along and find somewhere else to beg. Where am I? Okay, so, uh, looks like to move. Oh, okay, so after a little... Oh no, you, you automatically run, okay. Lost cat. Uh, no camera movement just yet. Uh. Hmm. Why can't I remember anything? How do I end up here? I need to find a way out. Okay. Where is everyone? I don't know, you tell me. Oh yeah, this was a thing uh, on the Vita version, like you can move around the the panel, and I think also in Gravity Rush 2, just like, the, this was pretty awesome. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Episode 1, from Oblivion. 
Huh? Let go. Please. Please. I need. Let go. Bother someone else. What? Wait. You don't understand. You gotta say my boy. Huh? Your boy? What's wrong? Is he in trouble? Bald mysterious man. Okay, we got an auto save. Oh, okay. Uh motion sensory, um Okay, nothing else so far. But no camera controls just yet. Okay, so we just gotta follow this guy. Oh, first person. Well, you're a superhuman. You can easily pull that. Uh, so. Yeah, the, this is a thing with uh, Sony Japan Studios games. Like they, they always got some, you know, made up language for for the games. With a, uh, you know, like with a, uh, it's called, uh, Eco, uh, Shout of the Colossus, uh. The last guardian? Yeah, yeah, the last guardian. I wonder why. Like, it, it's a mix of Japanese and some other language. The storm is coming. Hmm. I really want to control my camera. Why would you leave your kid there? Oh, oh, oh. And you expect me to help him? <laughs> What's going on? H hurry! You saw him up there. My boy's trapped in that house. He'll get taken by the storm. But what am I supposed to do? You're like that crow girl, right? Use that cat to get up there and save him. Crow girl? What crow girl? Oh, drop the act. I saw you plunge from the sky and land without a scratch. Use that superpower of yours and go get my boy. Superpower? Don't look at me with those eyes. I don't have any superpower, so... Well, never mind that. Uh. Okay. <laughs> I'm. I'm standing on a wall? Did you do this? Head towards the marker. Okay, uh. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so we're we're heading over here. Oh, oh, uh, 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 control, control your powers, girl. Well, he said. <laughs> you going to save him? What? <laughs> Wow, that was placed so mysterious, so specific. <laughs> R1, then R1 while floating, shift 
gravity and fall for it. I made it. Alright, and forward. One step at a time. Uh, <laughs> like, that, that's when it's really taking its time, right? <laughs> uh, but it, it's each just a game. Okay, uh. Oh, jump. Hold on, kid, I'm coming! So we just got control of gravity all the way up there. Now I really love the backs of that. But that, that, that was a hand, right? <laughs> what the heck was that? So we just gotta keep on going. Getting closer. Oh, right here. Yeah, I don't think I'll really be using the motion controls unless it's absolutely necessary. Uh, jump where? Uh, have to land here and then jump. Almost there. Okay, got float there. Yeah, so. This is not a really good guy if you have motion sickness. Well, that guy's not gonna be in Rush Hour 3. Oh. Technically, she should always have that power on. If if it's off, then then uh, she she should be falling. Save that house. Okay, so it's not a house, it's a hallway. <laughs> yeah, you're not strong enough. <laughs> oh, what did you do? I... I didn't... You didn't what? I asked you to save my boy, not destroy my house! Oh, okay, so it is his house. Our house! Give us back our house! But it wasn't my fault. I was trying to stop you from falling. Great job you did that. I knew I shouldn't trust a gravity shifter. Bunch of good for nothing troublemakers. All of Mom's things were in the house. You gotta bring it back now. But wait, was was noise coming from the controller? I I didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, it's, it's come from the controller. <laughs> hey. Where are we going? Hmm. Shifters are all rotten. You said it, Pops. What was I supposed to do? I was only trying to help. Hmm? What is it? You see something? A door? Hello? 
Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> Let's dream much free. It's a cool place of fish you do one thing. Plus you to do. Plans shall be man to rest up plans shall fade. The blessing low victory shall plan to the safe. What are you anyway? Were you the one changing gravity? <sighs> what now? I guess we're both alone, so we better stick together. I suppose I should give you a name, huh? How about Dusty? You like that? Here, Dusty. Here, kitty kitty. What? You don't like it? I think it's a great name. <laughs> huh? Was that a crow? Hey, Dusty, wait! Catch Dusty. Alright, so... I'm guessing we're, we have full control, kind of. But yeah, uh... Welcome to Gravity Rush. Uh, uh like I said before, this is gonna be mainly... Blind, because that last play I've seen was from many years ago. Like I feel like it was like seven years ago. Whenever like, because I think this was a PS Vita launch title, and back in the day they didn't have you know PS Vita capture cards, and the PS TV wasn't even out yet. <laughs> so uh, all people had to do was record from camcorder. Uh. So, oh, oh, okay. Uh, anything in here? Oh, sure, speaker enabled. Uh, I think I'm gonna disable it just in case things come out of here and I won't be able to look here because I'm wearing headphones with the game audio going through here as well as my own audio. So, since it won't come out, the speakers I believe is just gonna play, you know, in the game itself. Um, I'll lower this a little bit. Yeah, we won't be able to look at the top three, the other three spots there, so. Whoa. Okay, so there was a crow. Ooh, where are you going? Don't run off. So, you want me to follow? Maybe I can use this wall to get there. It's going really fast. Now I'm setting off to that. Why won't you let me read? Or talk? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. So, do that. There we go. Shoot, I was so close. Uh, okay, sir, you're kind of my little tutorial. I'm gonna grab these. <laughs> uh, turn normal gravity. Get back here. Come on, sit still, would ya? Hello. That girl and crow are kind of... Ah. Okay, so, so... I won't try to talk anymore. <laughs> Seems like the game won't let me, so might as well not try. I'm a serious girl. You can, uh, press R3 to, uh, you know, fix 
the the camera. Reposition it. So two shadows up over the city. You, you just gave me time. I was chasing one of those thugs when I got surrounded and, well, you were amazing. But who are you? Hey, subside, will, will ya? <laughs> this is the girl I just saw. She's with that crow too. Wanted Raven. Uh, excuse me. Hmm? Uh, who are you? And what are you doing here? I, um, well, I don't remember. Huh? I said I don't remember. Look, I don't know who I am or what I'm doing here, but I think this girl might know. Really? You don't remember anything? Did you bump over your head or something? No, I don't think so. <laughs> this is like the start of one of those great suspense novels. No, get away! Huh? Beat the monsters. Okay, so square to kick. Hmm. Okay, so comparing this to you know, uh, two, I feel like the tags has a, a bit more punch in two. Okay, I think I might need to go back into the uh, audio because it sounds like her audio is a bit low. Oh, okay, so while uh, floating. Boom, nice. That in bam. Bet I bet take care of that straggler. Enemy marker. Enemy positions are indicated by a red enemy marker. When an enemy is off screen, the marker changes to an error arrow that indicates its relative directions. Move the camera with the right stick to locate the enemy. Well, <laughs> there goes that. Hey, okay, and uh, boom! Phew, I think that's the last of them. First the storm, now those monsters. What's going on around here? Yo, Officer Sid, where are you, man? You need to get out of here. Huh? Why? Listen, the powers that don't care for you shifters, you make them feel less, well, powerful. An unknown, uh, oh, an unknown with two powers who just so happens to show up at the same time as the monsters, you don't want, you don't want anyone making the logical connections. What connections? Look, just leave the expl explanations to me. I'll take care of it. If you say so. Good. Now get going. We'll meet again, Shifter. Yo, Sid, where are you? It was the day the monsters came and attacked the city. I didn't know it yet, but the strange police officer, Sid, was going to play a big part in the events to come. And I never would have 
guess the part that I myself would play. City Shaken. Recent rise in unexplained phenomenon. Mayor Boza labeled the monsters Nevi. Formed special police unit to deal with new menace. Officer Six single handedly takes the down Navi, apprehends thugs in progress. There you are. I was worried this city began to send someone. Huh? The city? Hey, this is no time for kidding around. You need to hurry up and refill this felon. It ran dry a few minutes ago. Fallon? What Fallon? How do you refill refill Fallon anyway? Oh, it's so hard to find good help these days. Look, I don't have time to explain. Just get over here. You know where the Fallon is, don't you? Here, take this map and just in case. Was I working for the city before? I can't remember. Roger, I'll get right on that. Thanks for the help. For the map. Hmm. Shadows over the city. It's a map. Hmm. Select the story mission icon. Uh. Is it already selected or Oh okay. Tutorial mission gems in the sky. A man working for the city thought I was hired help. The map it gave me came in handy, but I don't but I didn't understand how gravity NG worked and wasn't sure what to do. He really needed the help, so I decided to give it a try. It would have been too difficult to explain that I had lost all my memories and didn't yet understand anything about the city. But he mentioned fixing a fountain, so that was so that was what I decided to do. The fountain, got it. I'll see you there. Don't dawdle. Yes, sir. What have I gotten myself into? I better get over there. Found Plaza, Old Town, Old Noir. Okay, um, current position. Okay, so I'm guessing using the D pad. Cat's <laughs> spoilers, <her> name is Cat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> The the D pad uses uh, is is what she's gonna say. So destination is the next location. Current position, old noir. We don't have near main hole. Oh oh okay. So using the zoom. Oh oh. Okay, it's bigger than I thought. Okay, so we kind of have one, two, three, four, five, six areas. Okay. Okay, those are already done. Okay. And this is a pretty big area for a Vita game. Not gonna lie. Like, the, like, and, like, this is kind of powerful, like, T, like, I think this is an open world game, or, like, more, majority is open world, and you have, like, all the sky to, with your, is a playground, as well as the ground. So, like, it's really awesome. Okay, so we just gotta make our way over here. So how do you refuel a fountain? Where's the water coming from? Oh. Okay, yes, let's begin the mission. 
It's about time. You better get started collecting fuel. Collecting fuel. Right. Um, how do I do that? What is this, your first day on the job? You need to grab those precious gems floating in the air and bring them down to fill the furnace. So I have to collect floating gems? Stay with me, kid. This is serious business. Now, get up there and grab those gems. Sure thing. I'll do my best. I hope they're safe to just grab my bare hands. Okay, find 10 precious gems. Like this. Uh, oh. Got one here. Good luck! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. He dead. He truly dead. And no! Okay, uh, how many do we got left? Three more. Got another tutorial? Oh, laws of gravity. Oh. When cash shifting gravity, her hair and scarf will still bathe the laws of normal gravity. If you ever lose your bearings and stop and look around with the right stick. Okay. Uh, so, see, the hair is, is going to the left. Because that means the ground is to the left. Like that. And the last one. Right here. That's the last one. Alright, so bring it on down. Woo! <laughs> then we put them right here. Choo choo! Well done, well done. He didn't even use the instant collector to grab those gems. I'll be sure to put into good work for you with the city. In fact, would you be willing to work full time for us getting all the other city's facilities up and running? It would be a snap for someone with your skill. Wow, I must have I must have really impressed him. He was kinda nice. Uh sure. I'll be happy to help with the other facilities. But, can I sleep part time? Well, yeah, I suppose. That's more your thing. Such a terrible waste of your talents, though. Anyway, here. Take these three gems as pay for a job well done. Isn't it nice to get paid for your services? If you're, if you're ever... If you ever change your mind about going full time, just let me know. Thank you, sir. Wait, aren't, there, aren't these some of the gems I just collected? Okay, uh, challenge missions, repair city projects to unlock challenge missions. Challenge missions aren't required to advance the story, but they're a good source of precious gems, which are useful for powering up. Okay, uh, art one. Oh, okay, ooh. Upgrade the gate, you see. Okay. Hmm. So got a gauge usage, health, recovery time, shifting speed. Okay. Oh, these are a lot of 
I don't, I don't remember Gravity Rush 2 having so much uh, things to uh, power up. Oof. This sucks. This is a bad. Dude. Basically, trying to find a place to sleep, right? Uh. Okay, so now, now I can tell which which way I'm going, or place I need to go. So, a bunch of challenge missions. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Excuse me. Uh. Okay, so like all these gems, oh, they're all over the place. It's, it, this is gonna be a bit of a. Uh, <laughs> A little bothering for me, a little bit, because it's like essentially collectathon. Get all these gems to power up your, to power up your powers, and then, uh, and then I'm not sure where it goes from here. <laughs> I believe there are different gems that gives you different amounts of. No jumps in total. Well, like these, like uh, those teardrops gives out one. Uh, I'm not sure about the diamond-looking ones. How much those are? Oh, that that that's a lot. So yeah, the diamond ones. Gives you more. <laughs> boom, boom. So that should be enough for at least one more power up. Hmm. Ooh, 50. How come this one was just like, what, 3 and the rest has to be 50? Come on. <laughs> Alright, uh, oh! Touchpad. Oh, sliding on the touchpad is... Uh, okay. Sliding on the touchpad does her, uh, Dodge? Don't know why she does that. Uh, go over here. Ah, ah! No! Grabby. Back grabby. Oh, hello! Oh yeah, there there's up upper ground, low underground section. Oh god, this like this is a giant game. Oh, like pretty sure there's something underneath here, right? No. Well, but look at that, just like Basically, you can go anywhere you want. And, like... It's almost like sky's the limit, but it's also not. <laughs> like, you can go all the way up to the sky, and then you can jump all the way down to the earth. Okay, so, story mission episode 3, Home Sweet Home. I just wanted to catch a break. More than anything, I needed a place to just be myself and think. Now if I 
Now if that place I happen to come with a shower and a means of doing laundry, all the better. I definitely could have used a little cleaning up. Alright, so let's just head up here. Uh. Ah. Okay, no, no, we can't actually enter. Ah, you're good up. And a hard face plant. <laughs> okay, so getting a bit close. I kind of wish there was a little mini map, but I understand that it would be a bit hard to have a mini map for a giant place like this that has the sky, the main ground, and the underground. Also. It's funny seeing people get thrown around with my powers. Let's begin the mission. How am I supposed to get get by in this place? No home, no place to take a hot shower. <laughs> Your traditional Looney Tunes. Ah! Ow! Ow! bad not bad at all maybe I am maybe I really am gonna be okay this place looks built to last yeah what do you know leads right outside Looks like I found my new home. Home sweet home, episode three. Got the furniture for the new room. This place could use some sprucing up. I guess we should start with the furniture. Tessie, what do you think? Any ideas? Alrighty then. Huh? Was that a scream? Help! Somebody help me! Did she hear that? Sounds like she needs her help. Where is she? We better find her. Fast. I think that voice was coming from up above. Oh, uh, let's grab this. Uh, it's 20 meters. Uh. Oh, there it is. There we go. Are you alright? The monsters are gone. You're safe now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'm not sure I approve of that outfit, but I suppose I'm in no position to complain. Huh? What's wrong with my outfit? Um, so, where's your house? Will you be... Will you be able to get home okay? Oh, I'll be fine. I'm old, but not dead, you know. But boy, I can't wait to give that daughter-in-law of mine a piece of my mind. She sent me to get rid of this chair, and look what happened. I bet this was set up. A chair, you say? Here, why don't you let me take care of that? You should get back to, back home and rest. You would help it, oh poor old woman. Oh, I wish my daughter-in-law was more like you. Why, back in my day... This sounds like my signal to kind of run. <laughs> oh, look at the time. I better hurry and get rid of this chair for you. 
Generate the Stasis Field. Hauling objects with the Stasis Field. Press circle to grab nearby objects in Stasis Field. Anything trapped in this field will travel with you as long as you move. If you run out of energy, you'll drop whatever you're carrying. Okay. Oh, okay, it's cool. So we can just drop if we have to. So just gonna do the thing. Good. Nice. Perfect. I'm starting to get into this. What should I look for next? Hmm. What should you do about the rest of the furniture? Talking citizens. Certain citizens may be willing to offer useful information if you talk to them. Select the dialog icon on the map screen to set the navigation panel to their location. Select the talk bubble to start navigation. Okay. All right, got that set up. Hmm. Saying, oh yeah, take the shortcut. Don't have to waste all my time getting back up here. And is this Sid? Yeah. Or or not? I'm so sick of studying at the, that desk. Studying don't mean none in the end. I want to experience things firsthand. I'm dumping the desk and heading out on the road to live life as a free man. Education enslaves just the souls. Actually, if you're gonna throw that desk, Ray, can I have it? I've been looking for one. Please, take it off my hands. I never want to see you again. It's back in the alley over there. From now on, just living like the wind for me. Woo! Not sure what's behind to him, but it works out well for me. Thanks. I'll take good care of it. So it's over here. High jump. Then when we shift gravity, it's super high jump. Maybe. Oh, really? Yeah, that small thing as a desk. Desk is kind of small, but it's cute. I'll take it. Then, cool. We can take the shortcut. Take a shortcut back home. My room is starting to come together. Have my own place is something. Now, if I just had a bed, I could get a good night's sleep. I need to ask around if anyone. Why is it going so fast? I, you know, just give me the option to like, you know, uh, you know, choose how fast it goes. You know. Ugh, sorry for the on. Oh yeah, uh... What's this? Save point... Yeah. Got that confirmation. Let's go. No, just gotta find a bed. Bed to sleep in. Cause sleeping is good. Doing the fast way. Ah. Uh, okay, oh. Another police officer. 
Yo, cat girl, it's me. Yep, it's you, all right. Cat girl, are you talking about me? Of course. Who else? They're the talking to the town. You're the black cat girl. Cat girl. Hmm. It's got a nice ring to it. Hey, you don't remember your name, right? Good. It's Olden. I'll call you Cat. You can call me Sid. Boy, when he makes up his mind, he really makes up his mind. Well, I suppose I do need a name. I suppose Cat's not bad. Not bad? It's perfect. Trust me, it suits you. By the way, you won't believe what the boss had me do just now. He's moving, so I had to haul his old bed and dump it off somewhere. Is that crazy or what? Wait, did you just say bed? Is that not like totally abusive authority or what? Do you have any idea how heavy that thing was? I could have thrown my back out. Uh, yeah, sounds rough. So, where exactly... Where is it exactly? I need a bed. Huh? You want that old thing? Well, it's yours if you can figure out how to carry it. I'm up there over by the old factory. The old factory. Got it. And Sid, thanks. I like my new name. No problem, Cat. It's a little reward for your help earlier. Good luck carrying that thing. Now, I'm trying to remember. Was Cat in PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale? I feel like she was. Especially for like the PS Vita version, since it like came out for the Vita. I think she she was in that. But anyways, let's grab these. We need to get as much as we can if it's around the area. Okay, so the bed's right there. Uh, oh, like that. Oh boy. I kinda have a feeling we're gonna have to climb this. One day. Maybe. I have no idea. Why have this giant obstacle here? If if they're not if you're not not expect to like go on it one day. Just getting all these jewels, gems, whichever. Gonna need that power up sooner or later. Oh, hello. So glad we don't take fall damage. <laughs> okay, and uh, should be over here. Yeah, see, well, like this game is just like it's super open world. Like you can basically go anywhere, and this is on the PS Vita, which should be. Just about as powerful as a PS3, or at least powerful, more powerful than the PS2. It's more powerful than PS2, most definitely, but just a little bit unpowered than the PS3, or just about the same as the PS4, kind of. Because it did get some PS4 games, or like there was. PS4 games that was also on the Vita. Either that they had to, you know, made it on the Vita first. Vita first, no, hey, what's the limitation? And then able to boost it up on the PS4. Something on the lines of that. So we got more of these jumps here. We can get more power ups. Uh, let's do more health. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's look at the other powers here. Hmm.
Oh, nope, nope. We're wrong button. <laughs> Oh god, I gotta find a way. Yeah. The texture is just not, not really that good. Well, like, Cat's Mall is pretty good, but, like, the textures on here, like, oof. I'm bad. <laughs> Going up here, please don't drain all the way. Ah, dang it. Nevi cores. All Nevi have red cores that serve as their eyes and their weak points. Destroy the cores and you'll destroy the Nevi. There we go. Nice. Oh, ow. Yeah, this one is... Definitely got got take from afar. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that was <laughs> that was super close. I almost evaded and uh missed my attack. and probably last one nice now uh any gems around here there's some up there but not right now any uh any, any place, you know, find a war porn or something like that, that'd be really great. I have to walk over a hundred yards to, to get back to the, to the manhole, to my home, my manhole home. Almost there. There we go. All right, that about covers it. I think I counted messed up the 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 motion controls on on this part because I was just stretching and like oh oh no. At the time, I was just happy to find a place to lay my tired head. I tried my best to scrounge together whatever furniture I could find. La la la. Girl's home really is a castle. <laughs> Everything was still so new and confusing, but I was happy to finally have a place where I could get away from it all. 
Congratulations on finding a home. From home, you can save your progress or instantly travel through Hexville sewer systems to any of the special manholes you've previously discovered. Save here to keep track of power ups level power levels and gems collected since the last autosave. Manhole travel. A few Hexville manholes lead back to your home. You can travel freely between your home and any of the manholes you previously discovered. So be sure to keep an eye on for them. Cool. So can I just... Ooh. Oh, costumes. Let's... Hmm. Uh, time to play... 101 Nights, Diary of Maid, Rules of War. You can just faintly make it out. At least I can see on my screen. Like, this kind of looks like a, a Catwoman costume. That kind of looks like a schoolgirl outfit. Obviously, this is a maid. And that, I can't really tell, but like... I can see her face, and her hair is in like a, a braid ponytail. But uh, let's save. Hmm. That was it? Huh. Alright. 